man versus slug. Today we're going to split the, the leeks up, they're all in a tray um, and we're going to plant them in individual pots. Uh, they're going to be going in the ground a bit later on, uh, but the roots are all getting knotted together. So um, could you go and get that bucket and f fill it up sort of with a couple, yeah, and, and just check it for leeks. What we're doing is we're just soaking the leeks so that we can get all the soil off the roots and that means that you can untangle the roots uh, somewhat easier. Now we're just putting one leak in each of the pots. We did buy a second tray of these leaks. I was kind of pessimistic about how many there were in each tray. And so we're going to have way too many leaks. So we're going to leave the other tray undisturbed uh, in case this transplanting of the leaks fails us. After all that, we've got 15 in the tray, but five in a pot like this. There's another five in a pot in the bucket soaking at the moment. We found four spare pots with the kale and so that makes 29 and then there's one that pulled out before we soaked it which isn't going to get planted. So that will be 29 leeks and then we've got another tray with 29 leeks and I dare say we don't have space in the vegetable patch for those but we will see if these ones survive or whether the other ones fare better. I don't think any of the peas are going to actually make it into the house. with the skin on, so I'm hoping, like this, with the bright green, they'll be a bit tasty. Here's the broad beans, the empty pods, the empty skins, they actually get really tasty. So lasagna with uh, lots of vegetables, but particularly having grown broad beans, which my children in for me are actually really, really tasty. so much bone we've grown in this lower bed. I'm not really sure how I'm meant to deal with it uh, with the no dig gardening because bone weed inherently needs digging up as the roots go so deep. So I'm doing my best just to sort of tease out the root as long as possible but it's still going to be present in the bed. I definitely welcome suggestions on the, what I should be doing with this bone weed other than regularly digging it out. Thanks for watching Man vs Slug this week. Not so much happening. Um, next week's going to be more dramatic. But for now, I'm just going to carry on pulling up by.